Good morning, guys. I am Tammy with Decorating Addiction, and I'm having a Monday morning. I can't get my words straight, so I've started this video already like 15 times. So just bear with me because I'm tired of starting over, and we're just going to go with it. So I hope everybody had a wonderful uh, Mother's Day. I know I did. I got to see most of my kids. Um, we had graduation this weekend. Uh, my daughter went to San Antonio with the band, so she was in and out. Uh, got to see my parents this weekend. That was fun. So I just hope everybody had a good weekend. Today, what we're gonna be doing is working in the kitchen and we're gonna be bringing some lemons and limes to this center over here to this island, not this center. But um, I've got it cleaned off or I got it cleared off. We've just gotta clean it and then we'll start putting things on here. And then we're gonna do a little bit of a lemon theme over there in the corner just to kind of bring the lemons around in the kitchen. So now I know before anybody says anything that this doesn't really go with the coastal. But you know what? I, I like it all. I like all the themes that are going on this year. So I just wanted to do just it all to have fun and uh, enjoy it. So let's get started on this. Hold on. Okay. I've got some 409 and it's for stone and steel. And so I'm gonna clean this counter off and get it good and clean. Um, this is the rest area where everybody's filling up their drinks. So a lot of spills and stuff happen right here. So we're just gonna and the first it. thing, I got this tray. Um, I've had it for a while. I got it from Pier 1 and it was $24.95. I believe it was 25% off when I got it. Um, I've got some bowls, if you remember. Um, I don't break them before I get them over here. I got them at TJ Maxx and they've got the lemons on them and there's three of them. So I wanna kinda elevate them here in the middle and then I've got my lemons and limes that I'm gonna kind of put around the bottom of the tray. Um, I grabbed some little clear containers to try to stack these up. Let's see here. Just to try to elevate because they all have the lemons on them. Aren't they cute? They were $12.99 when I got them at TJ Maxx. So I thought I would just try to get them where the lemons were sitting in the front. You remember at Easter, I had a stack of three of these that were that had the Easter bunnies on them. So they're actually the same kind of bowls except for their lemons. Um, now if you look, if you come out at an angle, you really can't see that clear bowl. I've tried to put some greenery in it, but I just can't get anything to work right. Um, but I like that. I think that's kind of cute. I had got these, I got this at the dollar store. Um, I seen it a while back and it's just a little cheap, it was a dollar. And then I had this little wreath that I had already put this buffalo check on, or gingham I believe is what they call it. Uh, so I thought maybe I could stack that to kinda hide that clear, that clear bowl. I think that kind of looks cute. And then this will fit in here if I can just get these flowers to, there we go. Maybe do that. And then let that rest. There. That kind of, and then I got this plant. It says $10, but I don't think I spent $10. I got it, I believe, at Marshall's. And I just cut some clippings off some flowers and stuck them in there to kind of bring the yellow up there. And just kind of sit that in it. I'm having a fit with that. I don't know why it's not wanting to do right. Oh well. Okay. And then I've got a, I just 
have all these lemons and I got these limes. I got a bag of the limes and they were at uh, Kirkland's for $19.99. And then I had gotten a bag of lemons a while back at Kirkland's and they were $19.99. So I thought I could just interchange. The lime kind of brings the green out is the reason why I decided to do the limes with it. And I thought I could just kind of alternate the yellow and the green. That maybe. Try to get all my leaves going up the same way. And then I had bought a bag of little lemons a while back at Hobby Lobby. They were, I don't remember how much they were, like three or four dollars for a little bag of them. So I thought I could stick these in here and just kind of fill in holes with them. The next thing I've got is this lemon tray, and I got it at TJ Maxx, and it was $4.99. And I thought it was real cute. And this was a stand I already had. I thought I could just stand it beside it like that. And then I got, I got this uh, lemon pitcher at TJ Maxx and it was $9.99. And I got, I found all of these the same day. Um, and I had this stand so I thought I could elevate this pitcher. And I got this at Hobby Lobby and I think it was like $6 or something like that. Um, but I thought that would just kind of elevate it up a little bit. I tried to put a bigger tray under it but I didn't like it. And then I found um, this bouquet, and it's a little lemon bouquet. I thought it was real cute. And they had it at Kirkland's for $18.99. So I thought, well, I could put that in there. Kind of play with it. But like that, real simple, easy. I love the lemons but not anything real fancy, but it brings some color into the middle of the room, and I love the lemons. I just need to get me a lemon candle now. So now, what we're gonna do is pull the lemons over to this area over here in the corner. This is where my, my Google Home is, and um, so let me get the camera moved over there, and we'll start decorating that area. Okay, so we're gonna do it over here in the corner and bring the lemons to this corner. <clears throat> right here is my oven, if you can see that, and then behind me is the stove. So um, we're just gonna put a little yellow over here. We're not doing anything just drastic today, but I had this, this stand already over here, and I've had it for a while. I don't even know where, let's see. I don't know where it came from. I think it might have came from Pier Ones, and it said nineteen ninety nine. But um, I've had it. I've had it for a while, and I've been having my salt and pepper shaker on it. And then I had this Google Home sitting over here, uh, because the Google Home I do a lot of recipes off of there. So I like it to be beside my stove. That way, if I'm trying to follow a recipe, well then I'm able to. So I'm gonna leave it over here in the corner like that. And then I had this two tier and it's kind of small, it's not real big. And I know I got it at Pier 1, but I don't remember how much I paid for it. So I thought I would just set that over here. And then I was trying to figure out how I was gonna put my Google Home over here. <clears throat> so I think this is what I have come up with. I wanted to get it cleaned off. Uh, man, I got some bags under my eyes today. Oh well. 
Okay, so we're gonna put this here and leave my Google Home sitting up there on the top shelf. That way I'm still able to see it whenever I'm doing a recipe. Um, and then I've got this Ray Dunn picture and it says drink on it. I got it at Marshall's, stuff just fell out of it. <laughs> I got it at Marshall's and it was $12.99. And so I thought I would, you know, I've got the Ray Dunn kind of going through the kitchen. So I've been trying to bring it through where I don't have just a ton of it in one place. So I thought I could sit that there and put some flowers in it. I'd gotten these these flowers at Hobby Lobby back whenever they had them 50% off. And I, I love the bright yellow and the bright green that's on them. I think they were like $7.99 for a bundle. So I just grabbed a couple of bundles. I thought I would just pop them in there. I mean, you really don't have to do much to it. Just set them in there. But uh, that way it kind of brings some yellow. <clears throat> Over here, I've got, it's a lemon bowl, and I got it at TJ Maxx, and it was $4.99. I thought it was real cute. And then, um, I found these at Kirkland's, little measuring cups. Aren't those the cutest? And I found them back there at Kirkland's on clearance for $6.97. And then I got these at Kirkland's, and they're the Ray Dunn measuring cups, so I thought I would set these over here. I don't know how much these were. I had a price on them. And then I had the spoon rest, and I found it on clearance. I think it was $3.97 at Kirkland's. So I'm just going to set it over here on my stove top to kind of bring the yellow over to it. So I wanted... Maybe for it to sit like that. I don't know if I'm in the way here. Just something like that. I'm not trying to do all fancy. I just want to kind of drag that color over to here. Just put just put a little splash of color. I've got some lemons and some limes. These are the rest of my little little bag that I had bought and bought and have bought. Put a lemon in there. That looks cute. Just kind of set these lemons around. There. I like that. And then I cut some pieces of these flowers off from another one that I had. And I thought I could just stick them underneath like this. I grabbed my wooden spoons out of my utensil. And I thought maybe I could put these in here. I actually had them over there in that picture and then I found that bouquet. So I thought, well, I could just stuff them in the front of these. What do you think? I think that's pretty cute. And then over here, you see, here's my lemon for my tray. I mean, for my spoon rest.
but that's it just something simple and it brought the yellow over in here i like the lemons when i went to try to find more lemon stuff i really had a hard time finding anything else that i cared for so as for now this is what lemon stuff i have and i'm gonna go with it i like it all right guys that's all i've got for you today i know it was short and sweet but um I didn't have much time to think about what I was going to do this morning with such a busy weekend. Uh, so I hope that you liked it. I know that there are several of the subscribers that are doing lemon themes. So I don't know if I've given you any ideas or maybe where to get some things at that are lemons. I've really had a hard time here in East Texas. I've, I haven't found too much lemon stuff and whenever I did... I didn't really care for it so this is all of it that I had found that I have liked so far so if I find some other lemon things I might grab some but um, I don't want to do too much more lemons in here because I don't want to overdo it um, as I told y'all I've got the coastal theme going on over there in the living room so I don't want to just overpower with lemons in here um, I want it to be soft on the eyes and I don't want one to take over from the other, but I like to go from one room to the other and I'm like, oh, I got lemons over here and it's refreshing, you know, and then I like to look over at the coastal and I like the relaxing thinking I'm on a beach, you know, kind of feeling over there. So I'm kind of liking the mixed themes. I know it probably won't be for everybody, but as for me, I'm, I'm enjoying it. And the farmer's market in there with the different vegetables. I just, I like walking into the different rooms and it's something different in each room instead of going coastal through the whole house and everything just starts kind of looking the same. So I like, I like the mix up. So I don't, I don't know if you do, but um, I do. So uh, I'm gonna quit talking now and uh, get my act together and get to work. Y'all have a good day. Bye-bye.